So I'm gonna touch it, open the Google Chrome. Wow, nice. Hi guys, welcome to another episode of the Unwrap. This is Jarvis. Today we got something exciting to share with you. It's this, the Huawei MateBook 13. Yay! So for the past few days, I've been using this netbook for my daily usage, like watch my YouTube, uh, my Netflix, check my emails and stuff. And I actually got quite a lot of stuff to share with you. So let's get into it. So for now, I'm going to open it up and then see what we have inside. Okay, wow, it feels very light leh. And then you can look at the size of it, look at my head. The book, the head. Okay, apart from the laptop, this is the charger. It has a USB-C port over here. Okay, so I suppose there will be a USB-C USB cable as well. Also, it comes with the uh, cable for like a converter from USB-C to a USB. Here it is, the Huawei MateBook 13. The screen is... Uh, is touch screen as well, so I'm gonna touch it and then see. We're gonna open, open the Google Chrome. Wow, nice! It is sleek and the color looks really modern. So, one thing that I'm quite impressed is by the, is the thinness of it. As you can see, my finger here, you can see just like how thin it is. It offers this uh, very seamless, borderless feel when you, when, when you look at it. Uh, feels like a MacBook, lah, I must say. <laughs> A cool function that the Huawei MateBook 13 has is the Huawei Share. It's a Huawei's version of AirDrop. If you have a Huawei phone, you can transfer your videos, your pictures, just by putting your phone on top of the Huawei Share symbol on the laptop itself. So a suitable comparison that we have for the MateBook 13 is the MacBook Pro 13 inch. For the MateBook 13 on SSD, you get two times more. So for MacBook Pro, you only get 256 gigabyte. For the MateBook, you get a 512 gigabyte of SSD. Second thing is the processor itself. On MacBook Pro, right, the lowest one you can get is an i5 processor. Of course, you can upgrade that, it will be much more expensive. But on the MacBook itself, it offers you an i7, Intel i7 processor. Third thing uh, is the RAM itself. Okay, for the MacBook 13, it has double the RAM at 16 gigabytes. In comparison to the MacBook Pro, it only has 8 gigabytes of it. One thing that I like a lot is the 3 to 2 aspect ratio where I can get more vertical space when I browse through my browser. The next thing is the weight itself. It weighs at 1.3 kg. So if you are somebody who needs to bring around your laptop to work for meetings and stuff, this is perfect for you. So the audio of the Huawei MateBook 13, right? the speakers itself is actually located below the laptop. And I must say this is something that I don't really like. If you put it on your lap on, or, or you put it on your bed, right? The sound itself will, will get muffled. The MateBook 13 has 25% more speed on their fan. But I suppose that is something that needs to be sacrificed because of the fan, right? It's running faster. It gets a little bit noisy, I must say. For the battery life, right? I used up the battery to like 1% and then I charge it back up to 100%. I plug it out and then wanted to see like how long it can last. So it lasted me around a good 6-7 hours for just a quick charge of I think the duration was only one, one hour one and a half hour it can last you for that long which is quite impressive however there are other laptops around that does offer a longer battery life but I think one thing that we should always remember is the type of usage that you are you are doing hi guys you are seeing this through the Huawei MateBook 13's webcam and I must say for this quality I think it's good enough next I'm gonna do some light gaming I know it only has like MX250 uh, graphic cut so I don't have huge expectations out of it all right I'm in the game already oh well, it feels so quite smooth here yeah, the gameplay let's see let's go for a drive so one thing I like to do is to drive to the beach oh this car looks good Overall, the graphics is okay. I mean, it's quite smooth. Oh, and I realized, right, after booting up GTA 5, I can really feel the laptop is heating up. And not only just that, you can hear the fan itself. It has its limitations. La. Getting a Huawei MateBook 13 will set you back at 1.6K. It is available at Lazada, Shopee, Challenger, and Cots. And together with it, it comes with a laptop bag, a Huawei mouse, and other free stuff. Through my personal experience, right, I always go for the very valued one. You see, wow, this wow, processor very good, la, the, the, the RAM very good and stuff. After using it for one year or so, it will start to kick already. That is one thing to be mindful about. La. If you are somebody on a budget, yeah, this is something that you can think about. 
Thank you for watching this episode of Arimek. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Bye!